I'm the prince of this town. That's a joke, right? I'm serious. That's my father, the Igwe. Yeah, so we're, we're doing our morning run. <laughs> yeah. Oh, See, my father. Oh, wow. Yeah. Nice to meet you. What a pretty one. <laughs> Igwe. Yeah, how are you, girl? How are you? Well. Yeah. My God. Pretty one. Come on. Yeah, she's beautiful. Yeah. Mandy, Mandy, yeah. right? Yeah. My name is Mandy. Wow. See, 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 you girls. Uh, uh, how, how many kilometers have we done? How many? Well, about two, Dad. No, 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 no. Oscar, I did three before you joined me. So I've done five kilometers that way, right? Wow. That, that's not true. Running, I mean. I, I can match you girls step for step. Yeah. Really? <laughs> Yes. There you go again, Dad. There you go again. Hey, that way or this way? Come on, I'm, I'm, I'm going this. This way? No, 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 no. That way. I've done five kilometers there. This way. This way. Ready? Anyway. This way is going that way. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Yes, hey, let's go. Yeah. I'm just too serious. That's your friend, yeah. Yeah. What? I'm just just looking at her. Huh? Well, I will talk to her about it if you want me to. Please, come on, talk to her. Right? Let her know how I feel about her. And this is what you call, you know, love at first sight. I do. Oh. I spotted her just. I don't know. My system just shut down. Hey, <laughs> Oscar. What? what? Tell me you don't have a woman in your life, and I'll tell you it's a lie. Admit you just want to have a fling. Come on, I don't it's want to me. Have a fling, come on, Bella. You know me by now. I want something really serious. I mean, I'm not getting any younger. If she agrees to be my woman, I could just make her my wife. I like her. Look at her. She's, you know, she's just full in the right places. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't believe you, but for the purpose of this conversation, I'm just going to pretend like I believe you, okay? And we'll see. I'll try my best. So when are you going to talk to her? When they run back. No, we don't have to wait for them to run. That we can just meet them up. Come on, let's go. Oh. Like, we, you will do the talking when we get there. Come on. Oh, it's okay. Ah. Oh, you should rest. You tried. Ah. Oh. Mandy. Yeah. You underestimated me. Now tell me, what, what else will I do to prove to you that this man here is... He's fit. <laughs> He's moving. I am not doubting you. But you need to rest. You're obviously overworked. You should rest. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I can see that... Uh, I can see that you are... You're a caring girl. Oh, and, yes. Uh, yes. yes. <laughs> uh, for a housewife. Um, Mandy, can I have a word? Right now? Yeah, right about now. Um, excuse us, sir. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.
What? Fuck, I'm in there. How did it go? How did it go now? For who? For, for you or for me? For you. Listen, I go after what I want. I mean, I'm not in for any other heartbreak again. But come it's the on. ego I want. Well, Oscar is a nice guy, don't you think? Oh, please. He can keep his niceness to himself. If you want to talk to me about someone, he should be the ego. This man here is a good man. And you know that. And, uh, what your daddy needs is my daughter, girl. I mean, that person. I mean, look at him. He's rich and he's the king. Come on. No, no, Oscar, please. I, mean, I don't want some, some fine guy that I'll have to be fighting for his attention from other ladies. You know what I mean, right? These girls, all they want now is money, 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 money. You know, I'm happy, you know. But then stop thinking of women at your age that you will never change. Well, let's, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> well, Mandy, I hope you're um, making the right Come decision. Come off it. You are also cute. Why don't you go for him? As for me, it's the yeah. Hi. 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 <laughs> oh, you really? Yeah, Mandy. So, when are we seeing Buddha? Oh, anytime. I'm just a call away. <laughs> right. We we'll, would we'll like to see you again. <laughs> All right. So, uh, yeah. Sure, I will. Do I, uh, do I get your number? Of course. Why not? Why <laughs> not? <laughs> oh, wow. Uh. Uh. Uh, I want to keep this. Hold on. What are you doing in my room with your books? Uh, uh, uh. Rose, do you still ask me this kind of question? I thought we have finalized everything in the village. You're mad. Huh? You are mad. Also, do you, you want to share a room with me? As mm. what? See, also, do. You are looking for my trouble. You are really looking for my trouble. Leave you are looking for your trouble, how? So get out of my room! I don't understand you. Listen, let me tell you. This thing you are looking for, you will see it too. Yes, you will see it too. I said get out of my room. Now. I should get out from your room. Get out of my room, you are pushing my box. When I have come for us to share the room, as we have agreed in the village, everybody agreed that you are going to remarry me. Listen, let me tell you. You will understand, have to understand that I'm your, I'm your late husband, younger brother. Mm. And if you're not going to marry me, you will leave this house. You leave this family. Husband. And you must marry me. Get out. For so you leave my... Jesus Christ. You are pushing me. Oh. Get out of my room. With, with, with. Rubbish. You don't know your class. You hey. want to marry, marry me. Yeah. Good. I'm old enough to know what I want. I don't want Oscar. I want the king. Well, the king is too old for you, okay? And you're not even good for him. Yes. He said he wants something serious. How can you even act this way? You already pissed him off. I mean, Oscar. And that's a bad sign, girl. Whatever. I told you I am no longer into fine boys. Yes, I prefer them older. I mean, thank God he's even a widower. I don't have anyone to compete with. Yeah, so he's the one I want. And Are you serious? Look at it this way. He's a nice man. And a king for that matter. Mandy, there is no sane woman in this world. Listen to me. There is no sane woman in this world that would do what you're about to do. Like seriously, I'm here to just guide you. You're about to make a mistake. And it's a grievous mistake, okay? I can't even comprehend it. The king over Oscar, as old as he looks. Listen, the king will not marry you, mm -hmm. but Oscar, I'm sure, will. And when that happens, <laughs> he's still the king's son, okay? The money is still there for you to enjoy, if it's just about the money. <laughs> if it's all about the money. Look, who says I'm after marriage? No. What do you want then? Allow me flow with the king and allow him spoil me with money. Oh my god. Oscar can always get another girl. I mean, I'm not cut out for this bullshit. 
Let's drop this topic now. Yeah. Let's drop it. Because obviously, I know that you can see through that. You cannot tell me that you can watch it through that. Eh? She's a gold digger. I mean, how do you explain that a young girl like that will ignore a fine young man like me and go for a elderly man like you? That money is the motive. She wants your money. Does it matter? It doesn't matter. That. It doesn't matter, boy. This lady has made her choice, okay? So, respect that choice. Yes, son. Take this advice, son. Don't lean very hard on the girl, right? Else, we're gonna fall into a trap, okay? But that you already fell into the trap. <laughs> uh, and I'm trying to hold you back from falling. I think I'm a small boy. I'm not a small boy. I wasn't born today. Hmm? Besides, I'm not just going to move in straight and tell her, hey, I'm going to marry you. I'm going to take it easy. I'm going to look at her. I'm going to study her. Okay? What is there to study? The girl wants her money. She's a simple good deal. You know what? Realize that you're not doing anything with that girl. You want a good woman? I'll find you one, okay? Find you some, you know, some girl who will take care of you. Oh, my name is Wally. Nothing um, matters. Greetings, my friend. Thank you, Wally. Yes, well, get us our food now. Yes, Your Majesty. Um, Your Majesty, Ichinduka was here earlier, but he said he'll come back later. Ah! Same water first, they're already. Dad, honestly, I said what I said. That girl cannot be with you. I do not want to lose you. That girl cannot be with you. <laughs> no. She can't. She's not your kind. So, um, let's look at this this way. See you. Make me look. And feel as if I, as if I'm not me myself again, as if I don't think I can't, nothing that I can't reason out things for myself. Oscar, saw a girl mm. who likes me. Mm. Saw a girl I like. Why don't you let both of us rule and then maybe later you can judge? <laughs> no, Dad. I don't want to lose you. You know what? I don't want to lose you. <laughs> I nearly choked on my food. <laughs> but I'm serious, Dad. I don't want to lose you. Mm -mm. Is this going to be a killer? Who knows? She's not your kind. Hey, Oscar. Sometimes I begin to think that maybe you're angry because the girl preferred me. Over you. No. Uh, well, yeah. Mm. I mean... Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yes, father, yes. I mean, how do you explain? Listen, that. look. Girls like that are what we call Ron's girls. Corporate prostitutes, that's what they are. How is it even possible that she'll prefer you to a young promising man like me? She wants your money. You need to see it, Father. You need to see it. She wants your money. Son, Dad, you know what I see when I look at you now? What do you say? Jealousy. <laughs> <laughs> You don't think I'm serious now. <laughs> so I'm this girl alone. Come on. I tell you in the end, this girl hmm. will end up being a nice woman. And guess what? A nice wife. Really, Dad? Mm. Uh, mm -mm. No. No, Dad. <laughs> no. Why are you going for? Did you just say wife? For a girl, just like. No, come on now, Dad. No. No. Just eat. You know what? Eat. 
Of course, I'm eating my food. <laughs> and I don't see you doing much of eating. You're I was listening eating. to you, Dad. You see, what did I hear you say? Asombo, your food is in the kitchen. Hmm. Those you are trying me. You are trying me. I've been trying so hard to control my temper. Don't make me lose it. Hmm? Don't make me lose my temper on you. Lose it. Hmm? Lose it and I'll help you tight. Asombo, I am not afraid of you. Stop threatening me. I'm not afraid of you. Rose, go and get that food now. Go and get that food from that kitchen. Come and pass it for me here. For me to eat. I'll react to Jennifer, react. Hmm. I should get the food and pass it to you here. You will react to I should start there as what? I don't understand. Also, leave me. If you're hungry, go to the kitchen and get your food. Hmm. Don't forget that your little husband, younger brother. Hmm. Who has suffered so much with my late brother to build this house? The food you are eating is my money. Osong, give me this. Osong, you are not going to eat this. Osong, you are not going to eat this. Stop your food. I will tell you. Stop your food. Why is this like this? What is happening? I have been calling, knocking. I was no one was responding to me, not knowing that you two are here fighting. What is it? Jen, thank God you are here. What is it? Thank God you are here. Osong, you want to kill me? Osong, you want to kill me? Even you like me. Wine. Hey, please, what is wine now? If you don't know what to say, shut up or you leave this place. Eh? Huh? Okay. 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 She must give me this food. Okay. If you don't go and get food. Okay. 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 I'll push you out. Get out of here. Two phones, thanks. Who's what is this? Listen, Bella. I don't want money for my father. Okay? What my father needs is a woman, not a girl. A woman that would take care of him. He's not getting any younger. He's not a spring chicken. My father needs a wife. Not Mandy, not her kind. Really? Yes. Interesting. Now, listen, I need you to do something for me, but I need you to keep it between you and I. Alright? Mandy does not have to know about it. Can you get me another lady? Someone really beautiful and classy. Someone I can introduce to my father. Someone that can catch my father's attention. I want to create some kind of distraction in my father's head. I don't want Mandy to get close to my father. Do you get where I'm going with this? I understand you perfectly, but how soon do we need this way? Like yesterday, like right now. We have to move fast. I don't want my father to get intimate with Mandy. Yeah. It's going to make things more complicated. Do you know someone we can talk to? In that case, I think I know someone I can actually call. Okay. My friend Laura. <laughs> Laura, okay. She's actually very, very cute and sexy. She's in this town? Yeah, she's sexy in this town. So what are you waiting for? Call her. Come on now. Okay. Come on now, Bella. Do this for me. You know I'll take care of you, right? I know. In that case, I'll just call her right away. Please. Oh, we don't it's have okay. time. It's right. okay, darling. I'll phone her. Come on. Hey, come down. Okay. Here. Your Majesty, mm. sorry to disturb you. There's a lady here I want to see. You. She said her name is Mandy. Mandy? 
Look at me, <laughs> look at me, look at me. Forget the house. Look How? at me, look at me. <laughs> <laughs> Admire me. <laughs> you look good. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Thank you. Hey, where is this boy? Come on. How yeah. have you been? Very good, very good. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Now, sit down. Oh. Yes. Wow. Yeah, yeah, you're welcome. Yeah. <laughs> so, what do we offer you? Um, water. Mm. Water will do. Like I said over the phone, mm. I'm watching my weight. <laughs> water? Yes, water. Ordinary water. <laughs> <laughs> Are you there? Um. Hey, you heard her. Come on, get get the let them get water for her. Ah, oh. Andy. Igwe, what you take me for? A long life of what? Papa, seriously, I do not want you to misunderstand this. Okay, think about it. It brings a lot to gain. Okay? You have to play this game with me. Please. If you were not my friend right now, I would have walked out on you. What's wrong with you? Can you listen to yourself? Listen, if we're talking about this guy in question, you will be here preaching to me. He's the one I want. Can't you see how cute he is? And he's rich as well. What would I be doing with his father? I am not interested. I am interested in him. Okay, so what would you want me to tell him now? That I'm crushing on him? What? Yes, tell him I said I'm crushing on him. Yes, he's the one I want, like I said. <sighs> Listen, if you can do it, then I will. Do you want to or I should? Huh? Oh, never mind, I'm going. Let's go. Oh, my goodness, this girl is spoiling the game. Igwe, I'm an adult. I know exactly what I want. And that's you. So can we forget about your son's issue? Well said. As a matter of fact, my son has forgotten all about that. Hmm? Good. Yes, but what surprises me is this, Mandy. How can a young, dashing, pretty girl like you prefer an old man like me over a young, handsome, very promising, well brought up prince? How? Oh. <laughs> Igwe. I learned something from my late mother. Mm. Mothers. You see, men like you will always tolerate me. No matter how naughty or arrogant I may get. So that is what I want. I don't want to be with a young rich man who I will have to keep fighting for his attention away from other women. Mm. So do you get me now? In a manner of speaking, but mm -hmm. the young man in question is, is young, is dashing, is handsome, 
and is well brought up. And to cap it, the prince. Fine, I totally understand you, but I mean, let's forget about it. My king, the food is ready. All right, thank you. Yes. So, my king, why don't we go to your room so that I can give you a proper body Bandy massage. You see, I I would very much like to indulge in relaxing and the body massage, especially from you. <laughs> yes, but I want you to see this relationship that's building. This budding relationship between us. I want you to look beyond massage, frills, frills, and fun, including all those frivolities of the young age. Look beyond all that. I need something more serious from you. Do you understand me? Perfect. Sure. No problem. Good. So, <laughs> shall we go and eat? <laughs> <laughs> That was pretty interesting, I tell you. It's okay. Um, Oscar, I would like to take my leave now so you and Bella can get to know yourselves better. Okay. Yes. Come here. Thank you so much. Thank uh, you. you know I owe you one, right? I know. <laughs> All right. Um, take care of you now. Whatever happens, I'll call you. Okay. Yeah. Laura. Okay, Boo Boo. I'll All come right. to you soon, okay? Okay. You right. take care. Yeah. Bye. Why are you looking at me like that? I admire you. Oh, really? Yes. But you were going to pass me on to your dad. Ah, no, you won't understand. Listen, um, it got a bit complicated at some point. You won't understand. I'll put you in the clear later. But for now, I just want you to know that you're a beautiful woman. I am my spec. Thank you. And I like you too. Mm. Mm -hmm. So why don't you tell me about this handsome guy sitting in front of me? <laughs> I see you want this conversation to take a different turn. Mm -hmm. I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I like you. I like you too. You're my kind too. Correct. Seriously, mm. you've done a wonderful thing by inviting me over. I can say that again. I see how God works in different ways. No, right? How you see this <sighs> life is so so funny. You can never tell where your ship will just sail from. I swear. I see I owe you my life. This guy is the perfect definition of a guy I want in my life. And to crown it all, I'm also his spec. You need to see the way we were talking like it was not the first time we were meeting. The chemistry, everything. Oh God. Oh my it goodness. was so cute. Oh my God, I'm so happy for you. Hi. Look at you. Mm -hmm. See, you have to settle me. Huh. Settle you qua. Girl, I say I owe you my life. Do you know what it is for a rich man like that to fall in love with me? Igwe son for that matter. Ha. Girl, no. Not be smart you do. I'm happy. In fact, if I leave here and I'm going to the house, I'm going to do serious fasting and prayer. <laughs> <laughs> to cast a 
only demon that wants to spoil this. I'm not joking, girl. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Come on. Look at you, my darling. Look at the smile on your face. You're obviously so happy. And I'm happy for you too. Okay? You guys are just so lucky. I just seem to be the unlucky one amongst you. Yeah. See, Mandy, she just ended up with his father today. And you. But me, I just. I'm just the same person that directs my friends to their destinations. Girl, stop, Joe. It's not like that. I'm thankful to you, I bet. Mm. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <too. laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Hello, son. Good evening, Dad. Hello, son. Hi, Mandy. Oscar. Mandy is here. <laughs> Hi. Father, I'll be inside. Yeah. I thought I thought you said he's no longer angry. Um go ahead. Use one of the cars and drop Mandy. Yes, sir. Mandy? Mandy, come on. Let him drop you. Don't worry about that. I'll talk with my son. Okay? Come on, let him drop you. Okay. Bye. <laughs> come here. <laughs> Take care. I'll see you, okay? All right. See you. All right. about the money. Do you know that this man did not even as little as kiss me? That is why I keep telling you that the older the better. Older men are the game. Huh? Hey. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey. Anyways, it's different strokes for different folks. Mm -hmm. Come on. All of this money is yours, not mine. But nevertheless, I am happy for you. I know. And of course, you know I'm not a greedy person. Eh? Mm -hmm. Which is why I want you to have half of the money. <laughs> Mandy! Eh? You're joking, right? I'm not! I want of this for me. All for you. I know you like money. <laughs> you can have half. Of course, I have Oh my gosh! Come here! <laughs> Thank you! No, Dad. No, no, no. I will not accept it. I don't agree. No. No. That no. No. It's not right. No. You know that it's not right. No. Do you want to sing with it? Go ahead. Go ahead and make a song out of it. 
Make us sing song out of it. No, 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 no. But I want you to remember that it was you who insisted that I get a wife. Oh, yes. A wife. What a girl. Not some call girl who's interested in your money. That, you're not getting any younger. You need a woman. You need someone more mature. Someone that can take care of your father. Can you not see what I'm saying? Oscar. What you just said now. Did you say it out of anger, jealousy, or love for your father? Love, father. Everything that I do, I do because I love you. Every fight, everything that I've said on this matter is because I love you and I care about you, Father. You are all that I have. Can you not see that this girl would rip us apart? You don't need her. You need a woman, not Mandy. See it, Father, see it. Oscar, you, you don't think your father is a child, do you? Uh, uh, hmm? This man here is not a child. This man here knows what he is doing. Hmm? I'm not going to tell this girl that I'm marrying her today or even tomorrow. Oscar. Besides, I I am comfortable with this girl. Yes. What is this? You are my force. Mm -hmm. Mama, so this is what you're saying. Is this what you're saying? Yes. Is that right? That's what I'm saying. Leave her alone. Take it easy with her. Hey? She's a woman. She's just trying to adjust to, 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 to a life she wasn't used to. I'm not against her, Mama. 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 I, I just explain it to you. Mama, leave him to shout. Let him shout. See, see, Osondo, let me tell you. I will not marry you. Kill yourself. Hmm? It's alright. Hmm. It's alright. Don't worry, I've called your mother. Your mother is here. My father is on the way. Listen, you will get to this place. And we'll send it to what's happening. Huh? No problem. My father is coming. He will soon be here. What do you mean, man? So you called your father. I am scared. Come on, sort of death. I called your father. See, see, let me tell you, father. Let the Igwe and all your kinsmen accompany your father down here. It will not change anything. Osondo, it will change nothing. I will not marry you. And let me quickly tell you, nobody, I repeat, nobody can send me out of my husband's house. Not even you. Rubbish. I think marriage by force. Rubbish. You call your father. So I should fly. See what you're about. You are supporting your daughter when you are an adult and you know what is right. And you are supporting your daughter not to do the right thing. It's alright. It's alright. Huh? Take this one if you don't have enough airtime. Use this one. Rubbish. Why, why are you behaving like a baby? Mama, he is a baby. He, is this one a man? He's a baby. Allow him to keep displaying his stupidity. That's the only thing he knows how to do. Uh -huh. Papa? Where are you now? You are, oh, you are getting close. All right. It's all right. I'm waiting for you. Come, 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 come. Uh, let him come. I am waiting. Let him come. It will not change the I will never marry you. You see this thing? You will not get it. You will die. You will kill yourself. You will not get it. You want to marry me? Is that how you're going to do the thing? It's all right. Like this. Exactly. You see what I was telling you? 
right, right there, that right there is what they constantly do. It's not the first time they're doing that. Why is Chief Chikwe doing all this? Hmm? Now, you know what I think? I think we should detach from this people. Yes, Father. We should detach from this business. It's not paying us. You know, they just wake up and then create new policies because they feel they have the numbers on their side. If we detach, we can start our own business and then run it how we want. Others go back to the same thing, same point. Son, settle down, get married, and begin to have children. All of them think that Igwe will sin as just one child. And that's why all of them end up poking, poking fingers into my eyes, stealing my company from right under my nose. I want it, Father. I will settle down. I want it. Huh? I want it. And speaking of that, Dad, uh, there's someone I'd like you to meet. Yes. So if you just give me a moment, let me get her. Right now. Right now, Dad. And I'm waiting for you. <laughs> Second, Dad. I'll be right back. <laughs> you won't wait too long, Dad. Yes. You're welcome, my dear. Thank you, Your Majesty. Oscar. Dad. <laughs> Oscar, you have very piercing eyes for things beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, Father. Yes. That's it. You have a good lady here. You're welcome, my dear. Thank you, Your Majesty. Sit down. Sit. Yes. Very elegant. Yeah. So, where are you from? Your Majesty, I'm from Ufuma, Urumba North. Ufuma? Oh, that's great. Ufuma is a great town. <laughs> You're welcome, my dear. Thank you, Your Majesty. I'm happy to meet you today. Mm. Yes, the feeling is mutual. Now I need to tell you that uh, Oscar here is, uh, is everything to me. Hmm? Oscar is my only child. Right? So you need to be very close to him. You'll be a sister, mother, as well as wife to him. You take care of my Oscar, right? Good. Even though my Oscar can be uh, a little stubborn, but I'm sure you know what to do. <laughs> Your Majesty, you have nothing to worry about. I will take good care of Oscar, and of course you too. Once again, thank you for your warm welcome and embrace into this family. I am indeed pleased. All right. All right. Thank you, Your Majesty. Oscar. Dad. Over to you. Good. Give us something. Thank you. Hi, Papa. You're welcome. I am so happy that you are here now. <laughs> How is Mama? Your mother is fine. You know, she said you should call her because uh, she's really worried and. Uh, she wants us to put an end to this matter once and for all. We'll discuss that with you. Oh. Hey. 
Aku Each time I come to this house, I remember my late soul. This is what death has done. Hmm. It's alright. So, uh, where is Rose? She's inside. Uh, you said the mother is around. Go and call them. Because we must end this matter today. Yes. Go and call them. Go and call them. Call them. Rose! Rose! This matter must end today. According to tradition, the junior one is supposed to take over the wife. I don't know why Rose is becoming very stubborn. Eh? How can I allow her to go and marry another person outside this family? No, it's not possible. I must end this matter today. I must end it. Ah, my dear. Mm -hmm. Sounds very exciting, you know? <laughs> You're coming around. You know what? Mm. I knew you were missing me. Ah, yes. Why wouldn't I? But not to worry. I am here to spend the weekend with you. Oh, come on. That's very exciting. I know. I mean, you all weekend? Uh-huh. <laughs> uh, I like that. I like that. I know. Yeah, you know, we're supposed to get to know one another. Yeah. Huh? Your Majesty, here it is. Good. Uh, thank you. Now, go... Go call uh, Oscar and his woman. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Go, go call them, go call them. <laughs> Baby, yes. there's something I'm, I'm going to... Uh, I have a surprise for you. Mm. Mm. What could that be? Hey, they are here! No! Sir. No, sir. Yes. Mandy, 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 Mandy. Mandy. Meet Laura. Laura oh. is... Uh, my son's woman. Hmm? Wow. My daughter in law to be. Mm. <laughs> Laura, <laughs> meet, meet uh, Mandy. Mandy is my woman. Oh, yes. <laughs> Hi, Mandy. Hi. Okay. Are you good? Oh, sure, I'm okay. <laughs> but I'm very excited to have her here. Oh, yes, Miss. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh, um, like he said, my name is Mandy. Mm. And I am his woman. Mm. As a matter of fact, I am here to make everything beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> very well. Very yes, sure. <laughs> um, Oscar? What? Please, why don't you sit with your, with your woman and mm. let's stay like family and have good wife. Uh, you know, Father, we're actually on our way out to see someone. How about we, we have that beautiful get together when we return there? Oh no, Oscar, don't say that. I mean, this is some kind of a family get together, yes, sure. right? Yeah, that's what it is. No, I think we should go make something for everyone. What do you think? That would be exciting. What do you think? <laughs> sure, sure. Oh, oh, that's good. That's good. Okay. Um, yeah. Um, yeah, that's great. Mm. We'll be right back. Okay. Oh, please do that. <laughs> that's good. Oscar, you will love this meal. Trust me. <laughs> yes. Yes. That's good. <laughs> they are both of them. Let's bring it out. They're comfortable. What's the point of this startup? What is this? What's what all about? I don't get you. Don't ever touch me again, you hungry gold digger. What do you think you're doing? Do I look like a fool to you? Huh? <laughs> Obviously, stupidity is written all over you. You are more than a fool. Listen to me. I am Igwe's woman. And not even you or that stupid Oscar can change it. And when the time is right, you will have to accomplish. 
called me some respect. In your dreams. In your dreams, Mandy. <laughs> Let me remind you that Oscar is the Igwe's only son. The heir to his throne. And I don't think a dying man leaves only son for an ugly looking witch. Huh? <laughs> Some make me hate you, Laura. You wouldn't dare, Mandy. Oh! Auntie, yes. Do you need help with anything? Oh, yes. Miss Lara, Oscar's supposed woman. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I have met her. I am glad to have you both here. The other maidens and I are always at your service. Mm -hmm. oh, in that case, come along. We want to cook. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that is why I'm here. Rose, we've given you enough time. Alright? I don't see any reason why you should fight my son when he's only trying to help you. Papa, Papa please, I don't like what you're saying. I don't like it. Let him finish. Let Papa finish. Oh. Let him finish. <laughs> mm. Will you shut up? Will you ever shut up? Be reasonable and shut up. My Lord, just continue. But I'm, I'm going to pay for something from you. Just give me more time. Let me continue to talk to her. She will come around. I know her. Mama. There is no need. There is no need. I have said it and I am saying it again. I will never marry your son. Do. So why are you making it look as if I don't have a choice here? And I have a choice. You want a choice? Mm -hmm. Oh, but you want a choice. Unfortunately, my dear, you don't have a choice. Yes. You don't. Look, I am the head of this family. And I decide whatever happens here. Exactly. We've given you enough time. This is one year since your husband died. You have removed your morning garment. So what is it? Huh? I mean, if you don't want to marry my son, we will settle you and you leave. Because I will not allow you to have children with other men for my late son. It's not possible. Never. When my son here is still interested in you, I hope you get me right. Because of your mother's appeal, I'm giving you two months. After that, if you still refuse to marry my son, then we will settle you and you leave. Oh, yes. hope she does. If not, she will leave. She will leave. We are not trying to help her. She, oh man, Look at this affluence that she's enjoying here, and she. Oh God. If she likes so, she should accept. She just missing opportunity because she's like a small girl who does not know the value of private part. Put something to it. Okay. Father, please. I, I really need to get something. Alright? Besides, I don't want us to get into some kind of argument again. But you see that lady? No, she's not for you. No. I'm not going to let you marry her. What? It won't happen. What's wrong with you? 
Oscar. I say it's disrespectful. Oscar, what's come over you? Why don't you be your age? What's happening here? I never objected to the lady you brought here. Did I? What makes you think you will choose who I go with or who I do not go with? What's come over you? Oh, I see. Perhaps you're not happy that the lady chose me instead of you. Is that it? <laughs> father. Far from it, Father. Far from it. That's then what, it. What, what is it? What is it, Oscar? Now listen, Oscar. If I do the changes I want to do, I tell you, you will be very, very uncomfortable. It's okay, Father. It's all right. I retract my objection, Father. You can go ahead and marry her. Whatever comes out of it, Father, count me out. I will not be part of it. Just look at the way and manner you talk to your own father, Oscar. Father, I have just agreed that you do as you wish. You want to marry her? It's fine. Just so we can have peace. We can go back inside, Father. Oscar. Oscar. What's come over this boy? Father. Ah. Let's go back inside. Why do you do all this to me, your father? Oscar. Why does he like to upset me? What have I done to him? Mm -hmm. So this is how life is, huh? Yeah? 50,000 Naira only is what Oscar is able to give me after all my dedication, commitment, and hard work. So, all I'm worth after helping him and his dad to hook up with the women they want is 50,000 Naira. Eh? Try. I see. Even the ladies now see me as the unlucky woman. Eh? Why do things like this happen in my life anyways? Why? Eh, look at Oge. She now lives in America, enjoying her marriage, courtesy of me. Me, Bella. I made that happen. Does she even care about me anymore? Of course not. Hey, if you chat her up these days, all she tells me is, eh, 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 I'll, I'll get back to you. I'll, I'll get back to you. This is what I get. Now, these two are now here to enjoy. All I could get is just miserable 50,000 Naira. Mm, it's okay. It's okay, no problem. Let's see how it goes. Hey, Mandy. Laura. Hey, we shall see. We shall see. Chai. Babe, why would you even do this? What would you have me do? I did not plan to sleep there. So let her stay until I'm ready to come in. No. You shouldn't have done that. If I were in your shoes, I would still be in that house. Like seriously, girlfriend, you have to start facing Mandy. <laughs> Face her now before the two of you finally end up in that house as co-wives. Bella, calm down. Calm down. Is it not Mandy? I sure know how to handle her. I know how to handle her. We are just starting. Calm down. Hmm. You have to, oh, <laughs> you have to face Mandy. You know Mandy is very troublesome. If you don't face her now, hey, she will use you and mop that house. My happiness is that the Igwe likes me and he likes me for his son. You see this game? Two can play it and play it very well. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh. Hi, babe. Hey, babe. How are you? 
<laughs> um, it's fine. Yeah, let him go ahead. I have given him the consent. Um, he can carry on. Yeah. What? Oh, sorry, hold on. My prince, hmm? Igor requests you come in for dinner. Tell him I'm not hungry. Heavy. Sorry, sorry for sorry for your distraction. What did you say? He would not even dare. No way. He won't even try it. Listen, I'm ready for him and his wife. Okay? Yes, they won't try it. <laughs> Don't worry yourself, darling. Alright? Um, enjoy yourself. Okay? It's Sunday and we're going to see each other with each other and it's going to be a fun field day. Alright? Okay, babe. <laughs> Of course, I'll talk to you tonight before I sleep. Love you too. <laughs> Bye. Oscar, food is ready. I was not deaf when Uri came here and said the same thing. Can you not see that I'm just not interested in eating your food? Oscar, why are you doing this? I thought by now you must have a grown-up attitude of yours. Why are you still bottling up anger against me? Mandy, leave me alone. Leave me alone. I'm trying very hard not to lose it on you. You hear me? <laughs> you wanted to marry my father. You have my father. Go ahead and get married to him. But I'm here to see how it would pan out. But I'll have you know that I'm a well-traveled and educated man and I am way smarter than you think. You are not going to see me coming, Mandy. <laughs> Is this how you want it? Fine! You know what? Go to hell. But know this, not even you or anyone will stop me from getting married to your father. I am going to be your stepmother, so you better deal with it. Nonsense. If you like, don't eat. I don't care. Rubbish. Which guy do they live, sir? I said, which guy life? to stomach these insignificant girls insult in this house. I've had just about enough. What did I hear you say? That what I am saying is that this girl right here is going to make me lose my temper. I'm going to do something crazy to her. Something you would not like. She cannot keep insulting me in my father's house. So father, we have talked about this suddenly, but right now it's blowing up right in your face. And I'm saying that you're going to have to make a choice between me and this fool right here. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Are you mad? How dare you? How dare you call a woman a law, a woman that I'm going to make my wife such degrading names? How dare you? Are you out of your mind? Did you hit me? Yes, I did. I did. It's okay. It's the first. Yes, the first. And I will again and again until until you get you grow up. No, no, no. Because I 
because of this one. No, no, no. What's wrong with you? Because of her. No, no, no. God. What's wrong with you? Going through this lonely night. I, I just want to feel your hands around me. Please come home. I miss you so much. Please. What? Mm. So the Almighty Rose has fallen for us, Ando. She will not understand. I. I am beginning to love him. Yes. This is two months since he left for China and I miss everything about him. I miss his presence. I, I miss him. Babe, it's not been easy with me. A, a single girl, a young girl like me staying for this long without... You know now, I'm, I'm, I'm tired. Honestly, I'm tired. <laughs> really? Rose? Finally, you have fallen in love with the local guy. Oh, yes. Did you say local? Oh, yes. You said he was local. <laughs> Sondu is not as local as I thought. I was in shock the day before he left for China. Are you, are you serious? Mm -hmm. No, 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 Mr. Lee, don't say that. This is an incomprehensible equilibrium. You cannot conclude yet. No, 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 no. You don't have to envisage his incongruence. We are fine people. We are beautiful people. We don't have problems. It's alright. Don't worry. By the time I get to your country, you got to understand the kind of man I am. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I'm with you. No, 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 you don't have to, you don't have to, you don't have to worry. Oh, you, oh yes, don't worry, by the time I get to your country, we have to perfect everything. 
Yes, we we'll, we'll sit down, plan everything, table it. That is very fine. It's alright. My regards to your family. Alright, thank you very much. Oh, this is God. This is good business. Doing business with you is good. Thank you very much. Are you serious? I am very serious. See, I was I was shocked to have heard him speak that way. I knew my husband told me he graduated with a first class degree from the Abia State University. And he also said he was the brain behind their successful business. But then, judging from how local and loud Osondo is, I, 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 I just could not believe some people are like that. Don't you know that environment influences people? Yeah, there are some people who can speak good English with good accents. But due to the environment where they stay, they intend to forget their class. What to talk of someone who roams, rolls and dine with local boys, I mean market people, what do you expect him to do? Mm, but my husband grew up in the same environment, so why is it so different? <sighs> Baby, it's not like that. Just calm down. People are different. Don't judge us or something because of that. Don't be surprised, he could be a sweet, caring guy when you show him love. You're right. Oh, see no more. Okay. I am just waiting for Osondo to come back. Mm -hmm. I will surrender myself totally. Fantabulous. You're doing well. Mm -hmm. I will surrender everything. Take me. Use me the way you want it. His father gave me two months. And my time is up already. Where are we give the same out of yourself? Uh, no, don't accept us on blue. Don't accept him. When I was telling you, you were for me boss chick. I know good. I know good. Mm. Now, don't worry. Get ready to go back to the village. Mm? Don't think of coming to my house. There is no space. My siblings are around. It's not work for you. Yes, it's not work for you. Because I am one. not even thinking of coming to your house. Better. As I'm like this, eh? Uh, uh, call me Mrs. Osondo. Mrs. Osondo? Mm-hmm. Mrs. Osondo. Because <laughs> when he comes back, I will give him just the way he wants it. Fantabulous. You know? Epa! Oh, Epa! Epa! <laughs> <You're real. laughs> Baby, why you want your cage? Let your feddy echo. Baby, why you want your cage? Let your feddy echo. Sorry, Aunt Laura sent me to go and get her something. Are you stupid? Did I not tell you I want to cook? Yes, you did, but she also sent me to get her something to cook as well. If I get inside the house and, and boil water for me! Ure! What are you still doing here? I thought I asked you to get me something from the market. Listen, my husband will soon be back and I need to cook. Now go! Sorry, Auntie Laura. Let me just quickly boil water for Auntie Mandy. Come here. Are you stupid? Are you stupid? My friend, would you go get me what I want? If you as little as try to do that, you will explain to me who's all that you take in this house. I am the queen of this land and you take others from me. Mandy, there's something wrong with you. Are you normal? Can't you see I asked this girl to go get me something? You're the only maiden we have in this palace. The real question is, who is paying her salary? Ask her, you better mind how you talk to me in this house. I am your stepmother-in-law. And the queen of this land. A foolish, ugly-looking one at that. What do you are you still doing here? I can go! If you try it. If you try it. See if you stop fighting, so I don't know what I am doing. Then go get what I ask you to get. Come back here. Are you stupid? Come back here from here. Get. Come, come, come. Get. 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 Baby, why you want your cage? Let your fed be a coach. I shall let you make it. 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 Let's just do this. Hmm. 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 Hmm.
I can't. How I love Goba. I know. <laughs> I can't wait to get pregnant for him. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I am so excited about this change of mind. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Mm. What? Uh, bring me to bring me back. Bring it up. How are you? Hey. Oh, How are you? Oh, fine, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That was the trip. I think it was fine. I hope you got something for us. I mean, oh, for me. Enough. <laughs> enough. Oh, yeah, right. Is that right? I'll be in my room, man. Eh? All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Is that right? <laughs> thank you. Eh? All right. All right. You're welcome. Dude, just, just come down, come down, just like this, everything will fall into place. Come down. I have this to All right. All right. All right. All right. Come here. Come here. Your water was boiling. Where is she? Where is that expired bleaching cream? Come out here. Come out. Because I told her you removed the kettle from the gas. Yes, I did. Why would you bring down my pot from the gas? Why? Mandy, are you mad? Have you lost it? What's wrong that we done to you? Oh, please. Tell me. Is that the only one I have in there? Can't you cook elsewhere? Can't you? So because it is your water, when it's overheated, I have no right to take it off the fire. Oh, eh? Tell me. Is it your money? No, 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 no. Or is it your gas? It's, it's not your gas. Gas to waste. Yes, it's your waste. Because it's not your money. The next time you try this nonsense in this palace again, I will beat you like a small child. Stupid ex. I got bleaching cream. Mandy, you are mad. You can do no such thing. It is your expired thing that you're going to do. You are gone. You are gone. You are gone today. You are gone. I'm kidding. I'm weak. Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? You filthy gold digger. What is wrong with you? Mandy, what is wrong with you? And the next time you lay your hands on that maid, the next time you lay your hands on that maid, I will show you a different side of me. Do you hear me? Why would And let, let me warn you, don't you ever in your lifetime think of picking a fight with my wife. If you try it, if you try it, I swear to you, in the name of everything you believe in, I will beat you up. <laughs> I'm going to knock you out. Why would you? Why won't you hit me? Obviously, you are a man, so you've got more powers. Huh? Why won't you say the way you are behaving without asking questions? Huh? Why won't you hit me? Did you just insult me? Oh, yes, Oscar insulted you. Oscar, I'm going to punish you, honey. Oh, yes, I insulted you. Honey. And I will insult you again. Did you just insult me? Yes, Oscar. I insulted you. Look at the way you are behaving like an old grand grown mommy spent. Mommy spent. Honey, please. Honey, 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 honey please. Don't oh, no. Honey, please. Come on, bitch. Let her annoy you any further. Just, just let us be, please. Please, my love. Please, let me. her run, please. Mabita, is that not the only thing you are good at? Beating women. Hit me. But let me tell you, any day you try to raise your hands on me, I will make sure you regret it. Just try it. I will make sure you pay for it. I will show you that I am your stepmother. That is what I am. Your stepmother, Oscar. Your I am your stepmother. Honey, honey, please. No, no, come. Honey, just let me. I don't know your plan. It is obvious you are a witch. You are trying so hard to provoke my husband so he goes against his father. Mm. Now listen, I will fight you with the last drop of my blood. Don't you dare me. Mm. Nonsense. Look who is talking. 
You will do what? You are the witch! You are obviously the white witch! Why didn't you allow him to touch me? You should have allowed him to beat me! I must tell the Igwe! I must tell the Igwe what Oscar did to me! I must tell the Igwe what he did to me! Oscar, you humiliated me because I am your stepmother! No problem! The Igwe was hit Troublesome person, eh? I was boiling my water on the gas. Next to Laura came. She took it off. And when I confronted her, hey! Uh -huh. Oscar said yes. everything to me! For real? Yes, he did. He hit hey. you! He said, you know, I'm not feeling fine. Ah, you know, I'm not feeling fine. I can't have this. Hey. I can't have this. Yes, sir! I won't have yes, this. Yes, yes, he said, you know, you can't have this. You can't have this, sir! Where are they? Where are they? Oscar! Oscar, come out here! Oscar! Where are you? Oscar? Oscar, I say, what's wrong with you? How dare you? How? That, that. How dare you? What is it? How dare you, Oscar? Oscar, this woman you see here is my wife! And you must realize that. In addition, this woman is your stepmother. And I must let you know that in no uncertain terms. Now, what did she tell you? What did she say to you? That I, that I hit her? Yes, you did. Did you hear that? Father, you say this girl that you brought into our home. If you do not call her to order and put her in her place, she's going to create a rift between you and I, and you're going to regret it. Oscar, don't make me do that which you and I are going to regret in this family. I am warning you. Your Highness, you're uh, welcome. No, don't greet me. Keep your greetings to yourself. You are the Confucianist here. Yes. You are the person causing all these problems here. What's wrong with you? Can't you keep keep your keep yourself to yourself? Can't you? Or you want me to hit you here no, and no, now? No, 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 that, Father, that, that, that will not happen. Please don't speak to my wife in that manner. I'm not going to allow you and those gold digger you have brought into our home. Oscar, what's wrong with you? There is nothing wrong with you. What's wrong with you? There is nothing wrong with you. I said, what's wrong with you? Your Highness, please calm down. Let me explain to you what happened, please. Don't explain anything. What are you explaining? And take your hands off me! What's wrong with both of you? Thank you for fighting for me. <laughs> Thank you. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Just, just come down. I will always stand by you. Always defend you, and you know that. I know. Now sit down. Sit down. Sit down. <laughs> 
Have you taken any medicine? No, uh, I'll buy later. Is that right? Um, sorry, I'll uh, take this one. Give to America. Let him get you some medicine. Huh? Thank you. Right. What's wrong with you? Please. Please. If you don't mind, I, I want to talk to you. Is there any problem? No, I, I just want us to have a word. Okay, okay. In, in that case, you know I have a guest. I want to get something for my baby downstairs. Uh, maybe when... Let me just attend to her later. Oh, can talk. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> Yes, and I hope uh, I hope you you've forgotten all those things that happened, right? What's that? It's clear to us that you need some space and we have decided to leave so that you too can have some space. But I tell you, Father, you are going to regret this. If you do not come with me, I'm going to leave you here. Oscar! Oscar! this place. You don't even go as far as that door. Dad, as it is right now, I don't even care how you feel. We're leaving. We're leaving. You want some space? I'll give you some space. You don't take me for granted. Like you have been doing recently. You don't stop trusting me, Father. I am your son. Let me go. All right? I can take care of my wife. Be with your wife. Take care of her. You want some space, Father? Let me go. We're fighting too much. Can you not see it? Never before have you raised your hands on me. Never. Not even when my mother was alive. Never. Of course, we've had arguments, Father. From time to time, we've had arguments. Not for once have you ever raised your hands on me, but you put your hands on me because of this thing that you picked off the street. Someone you don't even know. A girl that you don't even know well enough, like you knew my mother. You need some space, Father. Let me go. Baby, please, let me do this. Please, I beg you. Let's talk about this inside. Your Highness, your Highness, I'm sorry, but Oscar did not hit your wife. I was there. Ure was there. Mandy was the one that hit Ure. I removed boiling water from the gas because I did not want the gas to waste. Please, your Highness. Honey, please. Igwe, tell me. Tell me, why would she remove my water from the gas? Eh? Why would she? Just judge it. You can judge it. Just judge it. Eh? Is it right? Oscar, 
Please. Come and sit down. Son. Come back. And let's, let's sit here and... I mean, talk about this. No. Eh? No, Father, you can't change my mind. Laura. Take your husband. Let him come back. I mean, we sit here like family and... Talk about this. You have broken yes. my heart. Yes. No.